Hello everyone and welcome to another Minecraft video. I've gotten several requests asking to make a separate tutorial on just the installation of Buildcraft and Industrial Craft into a Minecraft server. So that's what we're going to do today. There are two different ways that you can do this. First way is the one that I tried to demonstrate in my last video but didn't really succeed on. So that way <coughs> is the do everything manually yourself kind of way. You have all your folders and files uh, which are Buildcraft Core, uh, Builders, Energy Factory, Transport, Minecraft Forge Server, and Model Loader Multiplayer. Uh, server. <coughs> you open the archive of the server.jar and you open the archive of Buildcraft Core and you then just drag everything in as such. doesn't matter what order <coughs> just takes a little bit time to do every single file I mean you can also do this. Guess that's a little easier. Select everything. Make sure to get everything. And drag and paste it in. Alright. Now when you open up your server it will load all of your mods and load the area if you desire to have industrial craft in there as well not that one then all you do is download the industrial craft server dot jar file and dra and drag it into the mods folder, paste, and as soon as it's fin is finished loading, you can restart it and it will load up with Industrial Craft as well. Alright, the second way to get the mods installed is a little bit easier in my opinion you got so we're just going to copy and alright so I have a second folder here nothing in it but minecraft server.jar this is the second makeup of a modded server I'm just gonna copy this over here all it contains right now is industrial craft server so what you do for this one, you open up the archive of Minecraft server and only <coughs> only upload Minecraft Forge and the mod loader into your server and then everything else just copy and paste into the mods folder and when you load the server 
it'll load all of your mods for you. <coughs> Excuse me. And those are the two ways you can create a Minecraft server with Buildcraft and Industrialcraft 2. Of course, you will need to adjust the server properties and everything else, like Ops folder, whitelist, that sort of thing. But that's simple makeup that you can do on your own time. I hope this tutorial helped. Thank you and goodbye.